Hello and welcome to the I Am channel. My name is Ibrahim Mustafa and I believe in you and I believe in the power of you to make money passively online. Uh, today, we want to talk about the top five Islamic niches for KDP publishing. So if you are someone who is into KDP publishing, and uh, you know that we have different niches and to target, to target different people. And the more you target different people, you give them variety to choose from. You give them opportunities to also see and get the books they want. So today we're going to look at the, the niches for the uh, Islamic people, like Muslims and all. So if you are listening to this from Morocco, all my top fans are from Morocco. Thank you for always supporting me. So if you are here and you are new to this channel, just subscribe to this channel and uh, say yes and put your country there. If you are from Morocco, I'll be, I'll be happy to see you putting Morocco inside. And I want to give a shout out to all Moroccans. So let's go straight to uh, the niches, since that's what we are here to do. So the first niche we're going to look at is Islamic coloring book for kids. So you can do Islamic coloring books for kids, Islamic coloring books for adults, just Islamic coloring books. So you can look at that and do different, different books, getting Islamic coloring books. So for adults, for kids, and you can just put in an content to target this be a group of people like children, kids, uh, adults, whatever it is. But make sure they are Islamic team coloring uh, interior. So let's look inside to see what we have here. So that if you also want to do this, you can also put in some content here. So it's going to be Islamic related Im uh, images. You can see, wow, beautiful masjid. Alhamdulillah. So you can see like kids playing and uh, one of the greatest of these is Islam is showing kindness to the weak and the sick, taking care of them and looking after them. So they are also, apart from the colored images, there's also a narrative to follow it. Something small like just to show. You can pick verses from the Quran or anywhere just to show. So you can see this one, very beautiful. Islam teaches us to be kind to our parents and respect them all at all times. So you can see, choose the type of respect that is. So this is one of the niches that you can actually look at, put in the, your own content and uh, reach out to people and make some impact in the Islamic world. So since we're all talking about coloring books, if you diversify and make more like in different categories, different niches, you will see that your sales will start coming. So let's look inside here and let's go to the next niche. So this is also another Islamic coloring book, having the intention for wudu. Great, the intention, the intention has to be from the heart, nothing needs to be verbalized. So it just sounds like something beautiful, washing hands three times, so coloring, people can color this, they can do more with this. So that is the first niche that you can target if you are into this uh, KDP publishing. The second one is, Islamic notebook. So Islamic notebook, you can just put in any content in terms of like images or your cover pages. You can just put in uh, like with Quranic verses, hadiths, whatever you want. You put it there in the cover and make it a notebook like this one. Bismillah is a notebook. It's a Muslim notebook. So let's look at it and uh, see whatever it is. So the, the, the difference here will be the the interior table of contents, like you can see just a notebook, normal notebook, but you can write here verses and other stuff. So you can do a Muslim notebook and this one and say, and say, my Lord, increase me in knowledge. So it's a uh, knowledge, it's a notebook, which is targeting like the Muslims, I think to, to her. So I think it's one of the Quranic verses to her uh, 114. So let's look at inside, the inside feature of it. And it's a normal notebook, I believe. It's a normal notebook, but you just have like targeting Islam, yeah, like Muslims in per se. So you can see that, yeah, the normal notebooks that you can write, publish, you can still publish that with the like Quranic verses on the cover pages 
and make it possible. So number three, the third one is uh, Muslim prayer journal. So you can do a prayer journal that is targeting Muslims. So we have five times, like five, uh, uh, you pray five times a day. So you can do an interior that, uh, let's see whether this one has, so this just normal notes, but it's like a targeting prayer journal, like pray Muslim prayers. So you can also do an interior that has a, like that targets Muslims praying, like the morning prayer, afternoon, evening, uh, afternoon two times, evening two times. So you can put it, those prayers in sessions, like put the prayers for people to be able to follow. So if people, someone prays like Fajr, person goes to tickets, so a person takes it, Maghrib, Ishai, so you can do that in that order. So five times a day, so for people to be able to follow, are you following the time or not? Daily Dua Journal, Supplication Journal to reflect and record your prayer day. Okay, so this may be what I'm, I'm talking about. So you can actually do something to target that. And uh, let's see what they have inside here. Okay, we may not see. So okay, all, all the date, and you put date you've prayed and all those the supplications and stuff. So you can do all that and to get people in that. So this third book actually is, the third book also is Ramadan Planner. So fasting, you know, we, we fast. Ramadan is a period of fasting. So you can do an interior to target Ramadan, to like help people plan, maybe meals, maybe prayer times, maybe whatever it is that you feel like it should be there. If you're Muslim, you understand some of this things. Then you can just put in, like for me, Ramadan is a plan, to-do list. What am I going to do? My preparations for Ramadan. I'm gonna buy sugar for my in-laws. I'm gonna buy sugar for myself. I'm gonna buy food. I'm gonna buy fruits and all those. My goals for Ramadan, to fast 30 days and to add a sister shawal. And so this is just a typical two of the day that you pick it up. So uh, iftar, suhur, you can see that like for Ramadan, zuhur, suhur, iftar, what are you gonna eat? We are, I am invited to, we, I have invited over shopping list, summary from the Quran. So it helps you keep closer to, to God. It helps you keep closer to yourself to record, to document and to know what you are doing. So. It's an interior that we can all do to start publishing and to make an impact when it comes to Ramadan. So as part of the niches, you can look at uh, Ramadan-related niches. You can do Ramadan notebooks, Ramadan prayer, Ramadan planner, Ramadan logbooks, and all those things. So the final one actually is Muslim gratitude journal. So you can also put in a gratitude journal for Muslims. So let's look at this. Muslim Gratitude Journal for Muslim Women. So this is one of the books that you can actually do. So just a normal gratitude journal, but three minutes like Islamically, showing gratitude. So you can have Islamic quotes, you can have uh, a lot of things that's targeting Islam or Islam women. That. So it's just a mindful type of book that you can create to let people show appreciation, gratitude, and a praise and prayer and whatever it is. You can put this in coloring books. You can put it in different, different, different uh, type of interiors. So you can see the sales is not bad actually. It's making more sales up and down, up and down, which means that there's a, a niche, there's market in the Islamic world. And uh, since we all consume this, we need to give our people variety, variety to be able to buy books, to be able to do more. So if you want to do more, you can also do more. So this, you can go here. There's a place that you can go and actually get interiors and graphics. I always use that. I'm going to leave the link below for you to buy the interiors. You may not see the Muslim team interiors, but you can teach them to get more interiors. So when you come to graphic, uh, Creative Fabrica, you're going to get popular designs, fonts, you're going to get mega like beautiful fonts that you like, that you can use to write or to design Islamic team books or stories. So once you come to create like here, 
once you come here, you will be able to like see interiors that you can buy and start uploading and making amends. So you can get interiors here in Creative Fabric. So I'm going to leave the link below and for you to be able to buy and to create more opportunities for you and do more. So thank you for your time. If you believe that there's value in this, please subscribe to my channel and I'll get in touch with you. If you just, you can also help me by liking this video, by sharing this video to your friends on Facebook or Instagram or different places or even LinkedIn or Twitter. You can share it. I'll be happy. That is how I'm going to also get more people to watch this and YouTube will promote it for me. If you do that, subscribe, share, and leave a comment. Leave the comment of your country and I'll reach out to you. Thank you for your time. My name is I am Ibrahim Mustafa. I believe in you and I believe in the power of your dreams. Never give up.